It's been a busy day in the studio. The idea, and as you know, my ideas never usually work out, but my idea is to create a sunset with a lighthouse in the background, but I'm gonna do the sunset in a pour and then the lighthouse I will put on after. So this again is on a 36 by 48 canvas, pretty big. I don't know if I have enough paint. I'll find some more. It's all good. Stay tuned and enjoy the adventure with me. this mess here and I call it a mess because I think like this is the least favorite moment for me is mixing all this paint I don't like mixing paint anybody that says that's a paint pour says that mixing is like therapy they're lying at least that's what I think because you got to get the consistency right you got to keep going you gotta put add the water you gotta add the floater all you gotta add this this is something new that I got I don't even know if it's gonna work but I'm gonna try this instead of the Elmer glue today. So also preparing for a complete disaster. Um, but I did buy some of these, these fluid. I've never tried this before. And of course, yeah, let's try it on a giant canvas. That seems like a really good idea, but I'm gonna try them anyway, because if I don't have to mix, the more paint I don't have to mix, the happier I am. So I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna put all these colors together in, wait for it. A dustpan. Yeah, I don't have a big enough container. So I'm going to try to put it in the dustpan. I'm going to move it throughout the canvas. So this is just for the sky. And then I'm undecided on how I'm going to do the um, water. It, it might be a swipe. It might be a dirty pour. You know, I, I love planning, as you can see. So stay tuned to watch this complete gong show go down.
big surprise what I planned didn't work out so I deviated as I always do and I really do like these cells look at them they're pretty so what I'm gonna move on I don't like these ones I'm gonna have to fix those what on earth is that what is that one? Look at that big guy. He's got to go too, but I'll get it done. So this is the sky and over here is nothing, but we're going to get there. That will be the ocean. I think we're going to go dark to light to make it kind of like a crashing wave type scene, but we'll see. Kind of just make it up as I go.
All right, phase one is done. There are some parts that might look like a bag of hammers, but because it is the start of something much bigger, I'm really confident in how it's gonna end up. I do love the cells and the paint that I bought, the fluid paint actually worked out amazing. So I was pretty pumped if uh, I could find more colors of that and not have to mix my own. That would be a game changer. But this is phase one. We'll be adding a lighthouse in here. We'll be adding more texture to the Technicolor sky. And a little bit more depth to the stormy waves or what I am going to try to create. Thank you very much for watching. Stay tuned for phase two.